Today, we're gonna show you how to use the prospecting agent in HubSpot. I'm gonna walk you through how this AI-powered agent can transform your prospecting process from conducting in-depth research to creating and writing personalized outreach emails and ultimately even managing follow-up. Let's be real, prospecting takes time and this agent can save you hours of manual prospecting work. I'm Alex and this is How to HubSpot. If you wanna follow along, click the link in the description below for a demo. To prospect effectively in HubSpot, you need tools that not only help keep your outreach effective, but also personalized. The Breeze Prospecting Agent is your team's prospecting partner that handles three key areas. The first is account research. The second is actually personalizing those emails. And the third is outreach. Let's take a look at how the Breeze Prospecting Agent can be set up inside of HubSpot. All right. In HubSpot, you will find the prospecting agent under the Breeze AI tab right here on the side. Now, when you click to launch it, you'll see a friendly onboarding setup. It's super easy, let me show you how. So we'll set one up by clicking set up agent and let's create an internal name and a description for the selling profile here. That way the agent knows exactly the product that we are selling because you may have multiple products or multiple selling profiles. So I will add a name quickly here, and then I will give it a quick description of what I am selling. All right, next what you wanna do is enter in your company's website. We'll put that in right here. You wanna enter the website that has the products or the services that the agent is going to be writing the emails about. So if I hit analyze, the agent is gonna start analyzing that website and combing through all of our product pages, all of our company information and news to ultimately create a selling profile. Really, it's performing research and creating these profiles that previously would have taken hours in just seconds. So you can see here, it's kind of gone through our website uh, and it's populated a lot of our fields. Most of these fields are gonna be auto-populated, but you can see we can add things like pain points, industry personas, and more right here. It's a good idea to double check this selling profile before you move on. That way you can make sure that the agent has all of the different information that you want it to have when it's writing those emails. So I'll do a quick double check here. Everything looks good and we will hit next. Here on this screen, we can decide our outreach settings. We can send from a contact owner and ultimately default to ourselves when there isn't one. This is kind of the method I like to go for. So if I'm setting up the agent for a sales team, those emails are actually coming from the sales rep. And if something happens by default, then it would come back to me. So that way the agent is always sending an email from a person. What we can do here is hit next and specify what we want the agent to include in its outreach. We have a couple choices here. We can ask the agent to include a meeting link and hope that someone books that meeting. We can include an external URL, maybe a case study, maybe a product page, or we can even include a document. What I will do is do a meeting here because that is the goal of my agent and hit next. Here's where it gets pretty next level. You can choose between semi-autonomous and autonomous mode for this agent. Let me explain. So semi-autonomous, the agent will go out it will do that research of the contacts and the people that are enrolled, and it will actually write those emails for you and give you the chance to review them before they go out. So it'll draft the three emails, you'll take a quick look, make sure everything checks out, and then you'll hit start outreach and the agent will send. Now, you can turn on fully autonomous mode and let the agent independently do that research, write the emails, and send things out on your behalf without you reviewing. A good tip I have is to always give the emails a quick review so I will select semi-autonomous mode here and hit create selling profile. Just like that, in minutes rather than hours, I've set up my prospecting agent, making it easy for my agent to do that research, write the emails and automate some of my outreach. All right, now for the exciting part. Think about this. Every time you get a new company or contact assigned to you, typically that research piece alone takes hours, not anymore with a prospecting agent. In just minutes, it can go through and perform a comprehensive research study on this company. Let me show you how. So if I go into companies right here under CRM and look at our target accounts here, if we click see target accounts, this is where our agent's really gonna get to work. I can select any of these accounts. I'll click a few here and click research and the agent immediately goes out and starts performing that research. Let me show you what that looks like. If I click on a company that's already been researched, I can click on research agent 
in the account overview, and we'll see just how much information has been gathered. For each account, you're gonna get things like a comprehensive company overview, company news, job opportunities, and really anything you wanna know about this company is gonna be right here. What I can do is go ahead and go back to this tab and see that my relevant contacts for this target account have already been pulled in. So I can start that personalized outreach based on all of that research right here. If I wanna go in and draft a single email, I can do that, or I can enroll the contact in the agent's sequence. So let's look at a single email example. If I pull that up here, I can see that the agent has drafted an email using that selling profile we set up just a few minutes ago. Notice how this message is truly personalized. It's taken context from not only the selling profile I created, but also from the company, from the contact, and all the research the agent's done. Watch how the agent automatically adapts when I've changed this different selling profile. It's gonna completely rewrite that message to keep that same really, really critical contact and company research so it's still personal, but bring in the different values, the different features and points from this new selling profile, making it really easy to switch between different products or profiles and ultimately craft that perfect message. Let's look at our automated outreach capabilities and ultimately put this prospecting agent to work. So if I come back into HubSpot, Go to Breeze, click on Prospecting Agent, and then click right here where it says Enrollments. Here is where I can see all of the contacts that are enrolled in my prospecting agent, as well as the emails that it has written based on all the research it's done. I wanna take a look at an example. I can come here and see a series of three emails that the prospecting agent has written for this contact. Now let's say I have a question about where the agent got this specific point from, or maybe I just wanna learn a little bit more about that research. If I go here and I hit view research evidence, I can see how the agents actually researched this contact. We can see that it's looked at some company news, it's looked at the company website, and ultimately created an email that was based on actual research. If I'm happy with these emails, I can simply hit start outreach, or because this is semi-autonomous mode, I can go in, make a few light tweaks, add a bullet, change the subject line, and really make these emails personalized before I send them. We've gone through setting up, scaling, and actually automating your outreach with the Breeze Prospecting Agent. Get started with HubSpot and click the link in the description below. I'm Alex, thanks for watching, and I'll catch you on the next one.